to unscripted like i told you before we have shinies right here in the studio and of course she's a budding artist and she'll be telling us more about her journey in music welcome to the show thank you oh my god you look so amazing <laughs> you look so nice thanks all right so talk us through your journey in music maybe you can give us a little background about yourself and about how you got started the music and how the journey has been for you okay yeah. officially i started in last year yeah. may uh-huh. yeah but i had tried in 2010 but <laughs> yeah so i go back last year i recorded my first song now yeah. Yeah. then in, in like three months from then yeah. i recorded my second song then but now i have four songs oh. yeah nice four songs yeah. so how has the journey been for you since last year until this moment how has the journey been for you? Not bad, but it's a little bit uh, tough. Yeah. Yeah. Because I remember you told me um about some of the things that were happening in the industry and you didn't like them. Maybe you can tell us some of those. What are those things that happened maybe in the in the short time you've been here that you didn't like about the music industry? Okay. The fact that a lot of people in the like presenters these days want to play a song unless yeah. Unless you give in to their demands. Yeah. Yeah. Demands like uh, money? I'm a, what kind of demands? <laughs> uh, from ladies, mostly. Yeah. The ladies' sexual demands. Oh, yeah. That's from yeah. DJ. Yeah. Well. That's awful. Alright. But still, you told us earlier, you started back in 2010 and then you stopped. <laughs> okay. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. People are now better that. Your time really for college, and the people who wanted to help me wanted to help me. Yeah, yeah, and they wanted to just do it when I have the money. So I planned that I go back to school, finish up, get my money, then get back to studio. Yeah, yeah. So you already graduated. <laughs> yeah, I'm working. Oh, nice. Maybe you should tell guys that. That is, why do you think it's important for people to like as much as you're talented to also go to school why do you think that is important mm-hmm. knowledge is everything yeah it's yeah. power and it's everything yeah yeah so i went back i did a diploma in clinical medicine yeah yeah and right now i'm working for machaco county awesome big shout out to machaco county as well for the tour all right so um you have a new single out now it's called the Sina. tell us about that how did that come about mm-hmm. yeah Okay, Sina is about, okay, it's a true story about, okay, it was mm, some years back, yeah? I yeah. was in a relationship with someone when we were down, but when he got the money, yeah, yeah he left me for someone else, yeah. <laughs> that is awful, but as much as it's awful, it actually happens yeah. a lot, and that's what people don't understand, because people are out here telling ladies all the time, Look for that one guy, you build a life with him. <laughs> it doesn't work like that. <laughs> I don't know. Do you know Men, when they get money, yeah. they turn something else. They yeah. turn to something else, yeah? Alright, so in your case, give us a little bit. Give us more. What happened exactly? Milton and Bali and Laku. Because I actually saw that in the video. I saw in the video how you were hurting it. And then he met Sid and the side chick. Okay, just tell us, give us details. <laughs> okay, like it is someone who just did you. Yeah, like we say, Gina, but some do a do it. But new point or new point or do it, ma? Right? <laughs> okay, like we are catching like an Kwana hat, so get them here when we go to So like to look up for and everything. Actually, an issue is for there for him. Yeah. Then Akanda ku Akanda Kupenya, I can't just find that again. Akanda Kupenya, then Akanda ku go for the fans. So yeah, Akanda ku is one of them. What? Yeah. One of the fans. Huh? One of the fans. Yeah. The groupies actually. Let's yeah, you call it. the groupies. Mm-hmm. That's quite unfortunate. But anyway, you are here stronger and better. So tell us about um, the writing process for you as an artist. How? When do you write? Because you are working and then you're also an artist. How do you find a balance actually uh, between music, okay, between singing and then uh, writing and then school, work? Uh, yeah. Okay, just for time. If you have a 
passion for anything, yeah. you'll find time for it. <laughs> yeah, I find time. Okay, and I ha- also na say you wanna send it to J. J. Mbeki from Tanzania. Oh. Yeah, that's a people have been asking about the a lot of Swahili in my song. Oh, yeah. so he helps you write yeah. the music. Mm-hmm. Oh, that is nice. So um, in the Kenyan industry, you've worked with anyone so far? So far, yeah. there's another song coming out yeah. very soon. I featured a rap artist yeah. called Patos. Um, yeah, so, so what's for it? <laughs> right, are you looking forward to working with more artists? Na kama yes, nani, nani una chika kufanya kazi na ye? Na nani na kuinspire kwanza kwa industry ya Kenya? Industry ya Kenya? Yeah. Oh, right now? Mm-hmm. <laughs> no one really, but kuna watu nige penda kufanya kazi nao. Like Nadia, yeah. Nadia Mokami. Yeah, Uchile. she's amazing. Yeah, yeah. Otile Brown. Yeah. Chikuze from Mombasa. Yeah, yeah, I love Chikuze. Yeah. Mm-hmm. From Kenya. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, 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 I know him. We've had him, we've had him at Y on different shows before. Yeah, he's amazing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and King Taka. Yes, he just dropped an awesome album. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so um, moving forward, what do you want to achieve? Because obviously you, you tried music in 2010, it didn't work out, but you're back and you want to pursue it. What are you doing differently currently to make sure like uh, I talk about 2010? Okay, yeah. one of the thing is working yeah. on my fin- finances. Yeah. At least I won't have to do someone a favor for them to record for me. Yeah, yeah, true, yeah. True, true. The other thing, I want to, to do music different from the other artists right yeah so do you um for you to grow do you find time do you have vocal trainings or how do you work on yourself to make sure that you get better that you sound better than you did on the last song or just to make sure you you do better music how do you practice do you practice just tell us about that <laughs> not really but i'm planning to when yes. i go for my liver yeah. i'll start vocal training yeah. so that i can get better mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's amazing. Also, so this karaoke, obviously the show is karaoke, and everybody who comes here, you have to do a little a cappella for us. Let's make it to be a doggo. Bila le sauti ya studio ya nyanya na kitungu na royko. No, just you, the raw you. We want guys want to hear that. So maybe you can choose any of the songs you've done before. I love to make doggo. Just a bridge. See what I love to chorus too. I love yeah your song. All right. <laughs> okay. Nikita Zamba Tulipo Anzia Atakula ya dana dana Yali Otwana Ma Kiwanji Ani Kule Kukwama Kwama Mara Kusima Kuyumba Mifkoni Ame Kauka Mabumba Hali kaziri kubumba, usiseme Majirani hawaishi kasumba, utupia na ndere na ndumba Ila vado baba wewe ukavunda, chechemei